So, been a busy day for us here at Outlaw. Been uh, gearing up for our season this year with the uh, duck season, you know, coming up this weekend. We're gonna go out and hopefully get get us uh, hopefully a seven man limit on opening weekend. Uh, been scouting a lot, uh, going out and going out to our spots and seen a lot of ducks coming in. Uh, hopefully with this nice cold weather we've been having, it'll push some more down to us. As you guys know, we had a pretty okay season last year. We're hoping for a lot better one this year. So today we went shopping and went through the storage unit, got a lot of our decoys out, went through them, figured we've got more than enough. So we've kind of weeded out what we don't really need for the opening weekend. Uh, but we did, however, go and pick up another six pack of Zinks. It's great looking decoys. They're also very budget friendly. So, and you know us, that's, that's how we roll. Like I said, we're rolling through our decoys, bringing out a lot, a lot of the storm fronts. They're still looking pretty good, even after a couple seasons. So another thing that we bought while we were out and about today is more uh, Texas rigs. Well, the stuff to make our own Texas rigs. Uh, should have enough to do another two dozen or so, which we're really liking the Texas rig style compared to anything other, J hooks, just weights, string and weight. Uh, Texas rigs are definitely way to go, easy pickup, and uh, a lot better to carry them out there with. We've got three days left before opening weekend here in zone one. So go ahead and stay tuned right here, Outlaw Outdoors. Opening weekend's coming up. I mean, we know that part, but... Yeah? Yeah, yeah. Oh boy. Next weekend's gonna be fun. Yeah, I see it. Hi, I'm Chad Lambert here with Outlaw Outdoors. Just getting ready for opening weekend. And uh, we got Jeremy taking the boat out full, maybe six dozen decoys. So uh, hopefully you guys like the video that's coming soon. What is up y'all? So we're out here in the duck blind. Came out a couple days early. We're gonna have to fix up the blind. It's kind of messed up, but I'm gonna camp out here wake up nice and early tomorrow do some work on this we're gonna be uh, using one of my new toys I got I'll flip it around here got this bio life charger cooker right there you see I got cooking stuff bottle water the grill Tomorrow I'm going to do a cooking episode here in the blind. But got this thing going. Charging my phone so I can take this video. And then we're going to cook us up some mountain house for supper night. Having the chili mac with beef. It's going to be dinner. And then... We'll see how this thing works, and if it works out pretty good, BioLife, if you're watching this, we'll take a sponsorship. It's putting off quite a bit of heat, so that's going to be nice. And then, uh, 
as I'm cooking, I'll get this going again. Oil, so I'm pulling my water from my mountain house now with this. This comes with the BioLite life thing I got, and it has the measurement. So this mountain house calls for two cups. So I filled it up a little past the two cup mark. A big key is to add a little bit of water and then let it cook a little bit for about half the time, then check again, then uh, add more water if it's needed. I don't know if you'll be able to see this or not. All these ducks just landed. There's a whole mess of teal that are getting ready to land with them. That's the most teal I've ever seen. When I walked in here, this was just loaded. Right there in that, that, there's a whole bunch of geese laying there. Whole bunch of mallards, widgeon, some pintail got up and left. So, should be a good hunt. Well, y'all did pretty good. Nice steaming hot chili mac right there. That's just charging up this battery pack right here so my phone stays charged so I can keep doing videos and stuff and updates. So I'm going to mount down on this mountain house and talk to y'all in the morning. What up y'all? So stayed out here last night. Had some guys at like 2 o'clock this morning try walking into the blind. Which was kind of weird. It was 2 o'clock in the morning. Woke me up. But that's why we're more persistent here at Outlaw. We get out a day, a day earlier. <laughs> but uh, this morning, there were so many ducks. Probably could have shot a limit by eight. And I had a boat floating out in the middle with all our decoys and stuff, you know, that I brought out. I should have got some video, but my phone was charging and it's like dying now. So I gotta wait for people to show up so I can go get a char get my phone charged. Cause they just dropped me in a boat off and everyone went home last night. Everyone had work day. So now it's breakfast time. What I got going for breakfast. So this is a Amazon mess kit I got. I'll I'll have Eric link it in the bio if you're interested in it seems to be working this is my first time using it come with that the pot a cup the burner and utensils and a cup pretty good I guess I'm trying out first time today and we're gonna have some beef stroganoff for breakfast so I'm gonna get to cooking finish getting this water to boil and get it going Get out guys, sitting here cooking breakfast. We got birds just flying all around. There we go, breakfast is done. Looks fucking delicious, smells good. Mm. Mountain House, if you're watching, we'll take sponsors. What's up y'all, Eric here with Outlaw Outdoors. Uh, getting ready to head out, we're here on the Columbia River. Uh, it's the day before opening day of duck season. We're getting ready to head out, uh, spend the night out there. I got my sleeping bag, got my waders and my backpack here. And uh, all the guys are already down there, all besides Travis. Me and Travis are getting ready, going to head out there and uh, going to spend the night camping and then wake up tomorrow and smash some birds, hopefully. That's the plan anyways. So we'll uh, catch up with you later. Can you didn't see my sweat? Didn't, didn't, didn't get our pheasant stuff because we're... Is it focused? Oh, we got that. Oh, my phone's ringing. Yeah, guys, keep it down. Jesus <laughs> Christ, you're not professional, all right? <laughs> got the uh, Raptor Razor hat here and the uh, Dabbler Supply <laughs> shirt. The Excuse the me. Back. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so made it to uh, Duck Camp, I guess we're going to call it. Uh, all the boys are here and tomorrow is Saturday, so you know what that means Saturday's for What's the up, boys, guys? Saturday's for the boys. <laughs>
So I'll for all the juggalettes, juggalos. <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to get on my waders because this is gonna be comical. I was looking to find my shoes first. Yeah, there we go. He gave me like three Halfway there. Halfway there. Still getting this over here? In the morning? Yeah. Who are you? Oh, I made it. I'm the guy We gotta, we gotta tell everybody that you're going home. Yeah, going home for the night. Got a puppy in the morning. Bringing her out. Don't want her to get cold. Maybe run away. So we'll, we'll see you guys in the morning. Tomorrow's her first hunt. Yeah, tomorrow's her first hunt. She's six and a half months old. And so her sister will be here also. So we got two new puppies this year. We'll see how it goes. Nice. Jeremy over here getting the wood cut up for our little fire stove. Making some fine kindling. No, like a. Let's get him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 